What is up, everybody? This is Game That back to you for a Pokemon Coliseum episode three. In the last episode, we were... is it skipping? I don't know. But in the last episode, we were able to defeat the Team Snagum Goons and capture a new Magihita, which in nature we don't quite know. Hopefully, it is adamant. But when I looked, the special attack stat was unnecessarily high, so I am hoping that I am not modest nature, as that will be terrible. Why am I... I don't know. Let's... Sorry to break it to you, but I'm not about to let you pass. Or do you have this idea that you can take me on in a battle? Wow, who's gonna beat me? You are? Don't be crying if you regret it later. Mystery Troop Rosso would like to battle. He sends out Quilava and Grimer. So the Quilava is the Pokemon that we want. Quilava is actually a uh, shadow Pokemon. And we will be nabbing it from this trainer. And, um, I picked the Puava because one of my friends, Tanner, he, uh, appreciates Typhlosion, apparently. It's his favorite Pokemon. Oh, Nexus, there's a Pokemon with a black aura. Yes, and so uh, I'm going to bite it, hoping for a flinch. And, uh, I'm gonna confuse Jin the Grimer, hopefully for a KO. God, this battle theme is so good. And I am noticing a little bit of skipping here and there. It's not too bad, though. It's probably because I'm rendering out, I'm actually um, rendering out the first episode now of this thing, of this, uh, of this, um, oh he has a second Pokemon, of this game. So he sends out Splunk, he goes for Flame Wheel, so that's a good fire type move to have. Does nothing to Umbreon, actually fires special in this gen, so that's why it did nothing. I'm gonna go ahead and go for Bite on Quilava, and good news is it is faster than Umbreon, so... Maybe it has a timid nature, I can hope. Now I'm going to um, bite, spoink, and return on Quilava because return is physical. It's gonna smoke screen Umbreon, which is not good. So it knows two moves so far. Accuracy fell. I'm gonna go for that return. Hopefully it doesn't do that much. Now good, perfect. This may put him put me in the right spot. I'm gonna go for bite right on that. Oh my god. And he doesn't make the dumb choice and go for it on a. Wow, that actually did a little bit. And so I'm going to bite this point and throw a Pokeball at the Koalava. Where's my Pokeball? 15 of them things. And we're gonna throw it at the Koalava. Hopefully, I do manage to nab it. That'd be awesome if I could nab it right here and then use it against him. Come on. One, two, three. Yes! Koala was caught. Now go for that bite, and we do hit the bite, which is great. Super effective does not KO him, though. And he goes for the torment, so I can't use the same move twice. So that means I. I don't know. So um, I'm gonna go for bite on you, and then I'm actually going to switch out into Koala. Oh, you have an item. What item do you have? Charcoal. Night. Let's uh, look at the stats after I switch it in. This is this is like taunting him. I'm taunting this person because I'm using his own Pokemon against him. Oh, come on, Umbreon. Now he's gonna go. Yep. Yeah. Uh, I'm gonna go for taunt on you. Oh yeah, so this is the deal, if it's a shadow Pokemon or whatever, a stolen Pokemon, it it only knows Shadow Rush right at the beginning, it's a high power move with recoil though. Um, yeah, see it has recoil, but uh, if you looked, underneath the health bar there was a, a little little purple bar and it went down, and that's because we're battling with Quilava. I'm actually going to lead Quilava and Espeon, because those are my two Pokemon I want to lead with. You, you're tough. Truly or whatever. I didn't get to read it. So awesome. We have a new uh, we have a new Pokemon on our squad. Tanner should appreciate this if he watches it. What was that strange Pokemon? Oh, what was that strange Pokemon? What did you people do to it? That? It's a Pokemon that was turned into a fighting machine by artificially closing the door to its heart. No, you didn't? Okay. Please stop. Uh, yeah, they said... Uh, Oh my god. Okay, um, I'm gonna go heal up. Yeah, I am definitely skipping. 
I do care what the problem is. We're gonna go heal up real quick so we can get Quilava nice, nice and ready to go. Yes, please. The bad news is we can't like restore them for a while. And yeah, so we're gonna go right into the Pokemonsies, and we're gonna because it has charcoal. Once it does get its fire type move ready to go, it's gonna be insanely powerful. Insanely powerful. Charcoal boosted. You can't take anything from that. Hopefully we get a plus special tanking nature. I don't care if it's quiet nature because fire all fire types are special and Typhlosion does have a ridiculously high special attack stat. So now we're gonna go to the construction lot. Which uh there's nothing here yet. Hint hint, but there will be some later. Oh, what is that? Whoa, hold it here. Hold it there. This is a construction site. It's not safe a place to be. This is no place for tourists to visit. Go on scram. Okay. Do they really have us go there for no reason? And I didn't start my stopwatch. So I literally have no idea how long I've been going. Mr. Johnson, give a man a break here. Keep telling me I don't know anything. That better be true, Kale. If you're trying to con me, I'll know about it. Mr. Johnson, sir, I wouldn't think about lying to you. You gotta believe me, right? Alright, fine. I'll let you off easy today. See you. Wow. Hehehe, <laughs> what a nitwit. Of course I haven't got a thing to tell you. Hey, yo, bro. What are you looking at? I haven't seen your face around the corner. What do you got to say? This is Pyrite, the town of earth, wind, and money. You appear to be outsiders. You had best beware there are many nayer do wells. Okay. Hmm. You thugs must be Myra B's newest recruits. Well, shoot. Beat it. I don't have any money to give to the likes of you. Hey, yo, bro. Chill. Chill in here there's a red light there ah this is the prison ow 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 sorry chief but there's trouble afoot you see chief there's talk that thugs have been witness using strange pokemon huh chief you're not chief I beg your pardon I'm here Johnson that story isn't new I've heard all about it over and already oh oh chief there you are you're such a kidder ha uh ha -huh. hello my name is my name is Sherlos. I'm the chief police in this town. Are you two travelers? Yeah. I see. Well, whether or not it would be best if you would get out as soon as possible. This town's descended into a state of lawless chaos. I wouldn't guarantee your safety if something would happen. Okay, bro. I'm going to save real quick. Yeah. Yeah, we have been going like nine minutes. Whew. Let's leave. There's nothing to do here quite yet. But there will be when we come back. Bum, 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 bum. Are you two trying to sell me something? Well, sorry, I don't need anything. Please. Wow. Pyro Town has always had a history as a rough town. With all the muscle-bound roughnecks about, that's not a surprise. But when Duking was in charge, there wasn't any of this lawlessness that you see today. What comes over Duking? I don't know. Let's go visit him. Bum, ba dum, ba dum, ba dum, ba 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 dum, bum. You. Yo, your outfit's kind of weird, but you're trying to aren't you? Yeah. You know, it's going to do one of the things the town has. We have street battles on the game. Oh, wow. Chaser Calda would like to battle. Is that a girl or a guy? Centret and Talo. Who's the shadow Pokemon now? Hopefully it's Talo with guts. We're about to get a lot of shadow Pokemon here, which is good. Adds to the team. Bum, 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 bum. Oh, none of these are shadow. So I'm going to Shadow Rush to Talo and Confusion to Centred. Because Shadow Rush hits everybody. Uh, it's kind of like Curse for non-Ghost type Pokemans. It hits, it's like the question mark, question mark type. And uh, that does a lot of damage. So I'm going to take a lot of recoil. Never mind. Go straight for that peck on Espeon. 
No, Quilaba. Quilaba is uh, losing that, uh, goes for that thief. Lol. <gasps> he's gonna take my charcoal. Oh no, he's not. Um, so I'm just gonna do that and then do that. Confusion destroys face and he's gonna die. And, uh, unfortunately, Shadow Pokemon do not receive experience now, but when you convert them over, they gain all the experience that they did not get previously. Is that the Shadow? No. I don't know if this guy has one. And he's dead. Bum 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 there's also one more mechanic to shadow pokemon but it hasn't come up yet so i don't feel like i need to explain it quite yet god that confusion does so much go for that shadow rush that big rush dog and i'm able to knock out this slake off and um yeah not bad not bad if i do say so myself and um yeah, Quilava, Quilava, whoops, you're better than me. Of course I was. Of course I was. Are you doubting me? I tripped myself up, but you're not bad. Your Pokemon are tops too. Foo, foo, foo. I can see in your eyes. You're just like us. It's easy to see. Is this the hotel? I'm pretty sure this, yeah. Well, it says big letters hotel. I'm actually debating ending off the episode here. And I am actually going to end off the episode here. I want to thank you guys for watching again, like always, and uh, I'm going to go ahead and save. Um, I know this is a rather shorter video, but uh, I feel like I don't want to start the big stuff until I have time. And um, Yeah, it's around 12 minutes, which is a good length for an episode. So I want to thank you guys for watching. In this episode, we were able to get a new mem member, so which is always good. And I will see you guys in the next clip. Goodbye.